Today is a very special day where we celebrate the beauty of Earth and the beauty of nature. This is our home. This is where we live. And Earth and nature provides us with everything what we need to live. It gives us water, it gives us food, but it also gives us places to relax, beauty, and it gives us a lot of inspiration. Unfortunately, in the last 150 years, humanity less and less was living in harmony with nature. We industrialized our planet. We started to consume more and more things. And now after quite some 150 years, we came to a point where nature and Earth is telling us that we have to change. One of the most clear signals is the change in climate. And we all can experience it. Last year, 2018, we had record-breaking droughts. We had record wildfires around the globe. We had heat waves. The outlook of nature in this year, 2019, is grave. There is no easy solution for us what we can do. But there are ways and means how we can adjust ourselves to the change which is happening already. One thing is we all are aware we have to change our lifestyle. We cannot go on, buy things, consume things, use things as we did in the old days. People have to change lifestyle and reduce their carbon footprint. There are many ways what we can do. We can save water, we can reduce consumption of cloth. Go vegetarian. Avoid plastic. Turn scraps into compost. Conserve energy. Turn off your lights and gadgets when not in use. Turn off the water while brushing your teeth and shaving. Use dry rack instead of dryers. Take short showers and save water. Go paperless. Make use of solar energy. We can join hands when we travel and go by bus or we can go by train, which is very environmental friendly. Flights are not very nice. Cars are not very nice. They create a lot of pollution. So there are many ways where we can help nature. We have to wake up inside to the change which is needed on the outside. Therefore, we have to empower ourselves. We have to become strong-willed and we have to become an example for others. We have to become a change maker. How to do that? I'm meditating since many, many years and science also confirmed meanwhile, when you meditate regular, you're able to change on the inside. And that's what needed to safeguard and protect Mother Nature, Mother Earth. We have to change our lifestyle. We have to change our attitude. We have to help and live in harmony with nature and the environment and not exploit it what we have done in the past. Therefore, let us all join hands. Let us all open our heart to the need of the time. Let us meditate for Earth. Let us create good vibrations, good thoughts, loving thoughts for ourselves, for our friends and for Earth. Let us heal ourselves and let us heal also Earth. Let us change our action. Let us change our attitudes. Yoga and meditation is a very powerful means to achieve that. It is helping to change my behavior, my habits and my attitudes. Let us all join hands in this task to create a better world.